Rio Ferdinand has admitted that Manchester United manager Eric Ten Hag does not trust his players after the club's latest performance. Striker Marcus Rashford missed Manchester United training on Friday due to illness and was reportedly spotted in a Belfast nightclub for the second time. The forward played against Northern Ireland on Wednesday and Thursday and missed Friday's session despite feeling unwell hours later. He missed Sunday's FA Cup win over Newport, with Ten Hag admitting he had to deal with an internal incident. The VIJF expressed its regret on its YouTube channel that former Manchester United defender Ferdinand Ten Hag was unable to focus on football matters at the club due to off-field issues. Who else deals with this crap? He started it. Who should address these behavioral issues where these legends and these great people are doing what they think is right at the time we work with people who deal with a lot of issues in the public? We are the biggest club in the world. This is unprecedented. They don't let people do that. I like this. I have faith. Can this manager believe that the players are not coming forward in the center and at the top of the back? He can't do it. He's not sure if he can focus on football at the moment. Ten Hag will be dealing with the likes of Cristiano Ronaldo, Jadon Sancho and Rashford as United manager in 2022. Last October, Rashford incurred the wrath of his manager after leaving the club following a disappointing defeat to Manchester City. After the Red Devils lost 3-0 to Pep Guardiola's side, Rashford headed to Manchester's trendy China White nightclub to celebrate his 26th birthday. The party ended at 3.30 a.m., but it is unclear if Rashford stayed until then. Ten Hag commented on the issue in October last year. I spoke to him about it, it is unacceptable, he apologized and that was it. For us, this is an internal matter. Ronaldo and Sancho left the Red Devils after publicly criticizing the club and Ten Hag. I think Eric Ten Hag should be strong, solid and stable. Where is he going now? Who is it addressed to? If you go with Sancho, you have Rashford or Garnacho. If he did the same to Marcus now, he would make a lot of money in the market. Marcus has to be the one leading this team. None of us are saints. Scalesi, everyone thinks he's the quietest guy, but sometimes he goes crazy at night. He should have been one of the last people home or on the road but you try to get there at the right time. We really liked it. It all comes back to the admin. You have to be aware and not be a know-it-all manager. The damn world knows that you have to be more diligent and careful. If he did the same to Marcus now, he would make a lot of money in the market. I hate to talk about it outside of the 90 minutes, but it happens all the time. This has been going on for years. We're talking about a variety of scenarios outside the game, and it's up to the club, the players and the manager to create a culture where people are in control. Alright guys thanks for watching. Please subscribe for the latest Manchester United.